Hi guys and welcome back. So today I am 37 weeks pregnant um, and yeah <laughs> I've got no idea when it's coming. So um, yeah this week's been quite eventful actually. Um, the last couple of weeks I've been having sort of practice contractions like Braxton Hicks things like that um, but the last week has been crazy so I'm having to use my birthing ball quite a lot at the moment um because i'm getting quite a lot of cramping and i think it's called lightning pain and lightning crutch that basically he's making his way down and he's his head is like hitting nerves and just sending shooting pains right through me um really really painful they take your breath away i'm getting those quite often i had quite a few last night it tends to be the evening that it happens the most um then last week I had this really dull backache and it was almost like cramping like period pain that went on most nights I think um and my tummy would tighten and harden at the top but it wouldn't get more intense and it wouldn't sort of it was continuous so it wasn't coming and going which a contraction is so I'm pretty sure it's Braxton Hicks and he's just getting ready to go he's definitely dropped this week um but i've just been monitored again and they said he is low but he's not really, really low so he's not like ready to pop out but that can change at any moment so i did think i'd probably have him at like 37 36 38 weeks but um i'm not convinced anymore i've i've got a feeling i'm potentially going to go to 39 40. they're not talking about inducing me anymore um which is cool I'd rather have him naturally. He seems quite happy in there at the moment. Um, he's getting uncomfortable, so I'm still getting the water retention in my legs. Not as bad, but um, I've tried to exercise a bit more, so I've been going to Pranksy Yoga just to kind of stretch out a little bit, but my legs are getting really, really swollen. But the heat and humidity here is just absolutely ridiculous, so that's not helping either. So I'm going to show you bump. Um... It is well and truly a bump now. Let me pull my camera back a little bit. You might be able to see. So he's dropped a lot lower. <laughs> you can see how round he is. That's him. That's him from the front. So basically where I am here, this is where his shoulders are at the moment. This is his favourite place to hang out. You probably know where to see it, but I'm rounder on this side, he hangs out here. So this is literally his bum, and his back goes down here. You might be able to see him. He's like there. <laughs> so, back here, back here, all the way down, and his shoulders are here. And he likes to hang out his legs here. So where this big veiny bit is, this is where I get kicked all the time. And I'll try and stick some footage of um, kicks in that I've been taking on my phone <laughs> so that is bump as I said he is dropping um, so last week he was starting about here but you can feel that his bum starts there now so yeah I'm growing <laughs> um, I'm still being monitored twice a week because of the reduced movement that we had before um, and I've got a clip that I'm going to put in so you can see what sort of happens Um, I'm just sort of strapped hot with some straps um, which they give you to keep these are now my straps for the rest of the pregnancy and they put a sort of heart rate monitor on your tummy and I don't know what the other one is never asked but there's another monitor that goes on as well then you're given like a little clicky button and you click every time they move so they can sort of do a graph and it takes 20 minutes of continuously doing the heart rate and the movement monitoring and everything's fine there um he's the last two weeks he's been very very active um not too active his movements are definitely getting less strong i think he's just getting so big in there um he's running out of room but i think they're quite happy i see the consultant next week when i turn 38 weeks oh that's really weird to say <laughs> um but yeah it's um it's going fine he is like starting to struggle um I'm having a few labour nightmares. The hardest thing for me is sleeping because when I turn over, you don't think. 
and you try and use your abs and then he sat against you know my abs and they really hurt i've been getting a lot of feeling that my abs are splitting sometimes if i'm exerting myself so i had the hospital last week and i was running a bit late so i was walking quite fast and it felt like there was splitting it was horrible because i don't want to get um rectal diosis so yeah yeah it's been an all right week and um, just getting hot um and bigger and just guessing if i'm in labor or not has been sort of the theme of the evenings but yeah that is it 36 weeks um monitoring twice a week um trying to drink as much as i can and just sitting on my birth ball just if i get quite tight pregnancy yoga has been really good to go to I'm, I'm glad that i'm getting to move a bit and stretch and it does really release your back because i think we all get kind of a tight back because our center of gravity changes so if you can get to a class i'd definitely go to one the other thing is you might hear my shortness of breath i'm always out of breath i'm always wheezing it sounds like i'm i don't know that i've got asthma or something um i just <laughs> that all the time but i'm also suffering anxiety a little bit and when i get anxiety it's in my chest um i just think it's i've got a lot going on with work and i'm about to have a baby <laughs> i just think that's what it is but that is um, my 37 week update i hope you're all okay and hopefully i'll see you next week but <laughs> we'll see thanks for watching bye